I'm here at the Havana Club Distillery, um, around 50 kilometers outside Havana city center, and I'm with Sergio Valdez, who is the export manager at Havana, Havana Club. He's just going to tell us a little bit about the history of the distillery. So the distillery was opened in 2007, and um, it was decided to open the, this new distillery because the demand for, for Havana Club was increasing year by year, and uh, we decided that we have to be prepared for the, for the future. Um, for that reason, uh, we decided to open this new distillery in San Jose de las Lajas, uh, which is a place um, very special, special because uh, we have uh, here a very good source of water, special water. The most important source of water for, for the Havana city is here where we where the the city is placed, and secondly, uh, because uh, this distillery is quite close to the different ports to do the exportation of, of our products, and beside that also it was important that uh, this territory is uh, rich regarding the human resource, because we have quite close different universities. So for that reason. It's possible to, to to have employees with a very high educational level. So the the distillery was opened in 2007 to produce the dark rums okay. for Havana Club. And how many people work at the distillery here? Uh, today in the distillery we have 240 people. Okay. And the capacity approximately? The capacity. Uh, a nominal capacity is 12,000 uh, bottles per hour yeah. uh, because the capacity is defined by the bottling line. Okay, thanks for your time, Sergio. Oh, thanks to you.